I have respect for women, ultra respect for women. I like being around females, I'm comfortable. I can get with them on every level. I don't get like a predator thing going when I'm around demure females. I'm not uncomfortable around strong women. See, at night I watch the sky. I take another breath, I swim my new boy to the butt like it's the last motherfucker left. Just me and you evading enemies, let you get my last out of here and see ain't never had a friend like me. Remember memories so vividly. Was once a little dust kicking, now becomes a G. Who can I call when they all fail? Collect calls to my dogs from the county jail. Sending me mail, heard the blocks in the same shape. Ain't nothing changed, niggas slanging at the same place. The same faces, supposed to always hate our foes. This lifestyle is forever, watch the game unfold. Shitting crocodile tears just got life plus. And you wonder if these white judges like us. Just stay strong, we'll appeal, nigga, you'll be free. Down with you to the very end. Cause you ain't never had a friend like me. I'm down for you, so ride with me. My enemies, your enemies. Cause you ain't never had a friend like me. Nobody knows where we'll be. My enemies, your enemies. Cause you ain't never had a friend like me. I'm down for you, so ride with me. My enemies, your enemies. Cause you ain't never had a friend like me. Nobody knows where we'll be. My enemies, your enemies. Cause you ain't never had a friend like me. Now I Never had a friend like me Nobody knows where we'll be My 
enemies are enemies Cause you ain't never had a friend like me Tupac gave me lots of advice um, The most important advice he gave me was to be 100% real He said that if I was real with somebody and if they couldn't accept it Then um it was better to be respected for being real than, you know, to try to lie because to pacify someone else's feelings. So, uh, I appreciated that from him, and I followed his advice, and a lot of people cannot handle someone being 100% real. You know what I'm saying? And that's why I think a lot of people could not handle Tupac um, because he was about as real as they come, and it's like when you when you get that real, it, it, it almost seems like it's game. <laughs> but um, that's the best advice he gave me. And... Uh, since Tupac has passed, I have changed, but I wouldn't necessarily say it's because he passed. I've realized things since he passed. Like, you know, really thinking about death and what is it and, you know, why do people mourn it? Why is it supposed to be such a painful experience? Why is it something that is, like, it signifies the end when what I believe is it is not the end. Um, when Tupac passed, I realized there were, that there were a lot of selfish people in this world. That's what I realized. Um, everyone didn't want him to leave here for their own selfish reasons. And as soon as I realized that that's what it was that had me about to go cuckoo, you know, I was able to let go and say if he really wanted to stay here, he would have pulled through. But it was his choice and his decision, and obviously there's life after death. So I guess he decided to move on, and I'm 100% with any decision that he would, would have made, you know. So I, that's